Hi friends, I hope you all are doing great. It's me, Nikki, here with a kitchen DIY refresh and I'm going to do a spring brunch tablescape. I also want to thank the sponsors of this video, Blinds.com, for helping me with this project. So let's get started. Friends, one thing that I always wanted in my kitchen was plantation shutters. I think it would be a perfect upgrade, absolutely beautiful. And while in isolation, this was the perfect time for a nice, fun DIY project. And I am so happy that I worked with blinds.com on this project and it's all because of the process. The product is amazing, don't get me wrong, but the process was so user-friendly. They give you a designer and she was so helpful. She helped me make decisions. She was extremely informative. She was fun. The process was really enjoyable for me. And the thing that I love is she helped me talk through, you know, what should I do? Should I do it as a DIY or should I have them install? Because they offer that service also. They will come install and do the measurements. But I chose to do this as a DIY. So in getting the measurement, she walked me through it to make sure that I did it correctly because of course this is custom. She sent me samples of all the products we discussed, which made it super easy to confirm my selection. And then once the items arrived, we were ready to go. And Mike and I, you know we love doing our DIY projects. So we were super excited to do this, especially after being cooped up in the house. This was such a fun thing to do. Along with, in this video, I'm gonna take you on the journey of how we're gonna sit back and enjoy it with a nice tablescape and a spring brunch. Now that the old blinds have been removed, it was really a great opportunity to give that window a really, really nice cleaning. So I broke out the soapy water and I began cleaning those windows and window seals and boy, did it need it. Now it's time for the fun part seen my plantation shutters for the first time and ideally I would be nervous at this point because it these are custom and I took the measurements but the great thing about blinds.com is no matter what I knew that if the measurements were wrong or if anything didn't fit that they would replace them at no additional cost so that gave me that sense of security so I was really not nervous about the fit at all. I want to share a tip with you that my designer from blinds.com shared with me. You see this little lip here? This is a style of plantation shutter that is made for easy installation and I absolutely love it. It truly was as easy as hanging a picture on the wall. Actually, I've had some pictures that were more difficult to put up than these actual blinds. So that to me was absolutely amazing because when you see the finished look, you think that there was a crew that came out, there was a lot of installation. But of course, if you don't even want to do that, you can definitely have blinds blinds.com coordinate that service for you but for us we definitely love the fact that we could do this as a DIY and friends as Mike and I installed each shutter we could immediately see the value of our home going up it was such a great feeling it absolutely looked beautiful and friends this was such a fun project it was something out of the norm we were stuck in the house and so it's nice to really do something that really is just adding value to your home and it was a lot of fun it wasn't frustrating and i also had a sense of security because with blinds.com if you don't like it they work with you until you are satisfied and i love that about them it took us no time to install the shutters and friends, I absolutely love it. Please let me know in the comments what you think. I feel so inspired. I knew I wanted to definitely do a beautiful tablescape sitting in front of our kitchen window now. And we also did the window over the sink and I love it. I absolutely love it. And I wanted to get in the kitchen and do a fun little breakfast for Mike and I. I also wanna say if you're not subscribed to my channel, take a moment now and subscribe while I'm in the kitchen. So one thing I have been challenging myself to do while in isolation is something that I don't normally do. And so with our little brunch here, I'm going to make crepes instead of doing the typical waffles or pancakes. And so I wanted to make crepes, you know, and give Mike and I something different to have. And a quick tip is I like to put the current crepe over top of the rest to keep them warm as I'm cooking. And then I'll fold it once the next one is ready. And then I'll place that one over top of course we have to have strawberries to go over them that is the perfect combination 
And of course we had to have our bacon. The easiest way is to cook it in your oven, friends. So that's the way I love doing it. So I'm going to create a nice little simple half table tablescape because it's only Mike and I. And the theme of this tablescape is longevity. I want us to stay at this table for hours. So I'm putting books from my fireplace mantle. I took the centerpiece from my fireplace mantle because after we eat, I want us to sit around and flip through the books and talk about the subjects. Each book is on a different subject. All I'm very positive and fun and it's a great way to keep your family engaged especially during this difficult time and to keep us around the dinner table and so now I'm just putting the crepes on the plates which this is the kind of highlight of our meal putting a little powdered sugar on there and then we are basically ready to go so as you can see it's not a, a very um, detailed meal or anything like that but just putting the extra special touches of trying something new and making it a table of longevity so that we really are invited to sit around the table really makes it fun we're sitting right in front of and this was strategic friends in front of our new shutters really just to make us happy absolutely just so that we're sitting there we're facing the direction of the window and we're enjoying that we had this fun DIY project thanks to blinds.com I hope that you all are really really being safe now and I hope that you are home enjoying this quality time that you have with your families I want to thank blinds.com for working with me on this project and sponsoring this video I'll put a link to them below definitely check them out because they have a huge range of products that are very budget friendly and you really can enjoy the process of working with your home working within your home or you can have them handle that for you so thank you friends for joining me on this journey i hope that you will subscribe and be a part of the at home with nikki family have a beautiful day my friends and i will see you at the next video this is nikki saying goodbye